Your representative, Darth Tormund. Impressive. For an animal. The trap is nearly set. All that remains is to capture the last figurehead of Corellia's old regime. Corellia's civil police force commissioner. Somehow Commissioner Carter survived the initial purge of dissenters before Prime Minister Falcone delivered Corellia to us. Did the assassination attempt spook him into hiding? Hardly. Since the purge, Commissioner Carter has rallied the rebellion. The public sees him as the last legitimate voice of the Corellian people. Carter and his Corsac officers are the backbone of the civilian resistance. Corsac is one thing, but I'm not keen on dragging any more bystanders into this war. It will not be an issue. Corsac's old headquarters is now a formidable fortress. Our forces are laying siege to it as we speak. Their standing orders are to block off any escape. That is all. Can't we coordinate something? There will be no assaults until you have secured the Commissioner. Contact me when Commissioner Carter is in custody. My troops will cover your exit. Well, look at you. Waltzing in here like you own the place. Come to finish what they started? Go on and kill me. You'll have a million citizens rioting in the streets by sundown. Huh. Guess I'd be in real trouble if I were here to kill you. If you aren't out for blood, why are you here? I'm a bounty hunter. What do you think? I think you're greedy, amoral scum, here to sell me to the highest bidder. Imperials, I bet. The people you're working for, they aren't spice runners or thugs looking for a quick fortune. They're despots. Do this and you'll force billions of people to bow before the Sith. Is the Empire paying you enough to clear your conscience of that? Better they bow than continue to get caught in the crossfire. You're a real gentleman. Thanks for the chat. Now I know that what I've been doing is making a difference. Hit him! You got me. Good for you. You want a medal? You and me, this battle, the war, not even a blink in the grand scheme of things. Corelli has been around a lot longer than the Sith's little upstart empire, and it'll be around long after the empire falls. I've been to Terras, Commissioner. The empire knows how to make a lasting impression. They, they wouldn't go that far, would they? I'm not the one you should ask. Tormen, the Commissioner is secure. Good. Our forces have control of the Corellian Legislature. Deliver Commissioner Carter to the Grand Assembly. Your reward will be waiting. Prepare the Commissioner for the surrender. My lord! Your success is noted. Anyone else you're planning to add to this gathering? Your work is done for now. Enjoy the fruits of your labor. Watch these rebels sign our enemy's death warrant. Just call me when you've got something. Do not stray far. Darth Tormund desires your presence immediately. This way, please. A large Republic fleet has entered the system. It includes the founder, Supreme Chancellor Genaris's personal flagship. These reinforcements are attempting to consolidate at the Green Gardens. 
You know who leads them. Seros has been spotted? He is a conspicuous leader. June Seros seeks to urge Coronet City's Green Jedi out of their enclave and press the attack. When their forces are amassed, the Republic will attempt one last offensive. You have until then to reap your vengeance. I'll keep my visit short. Dispose of Seros. Quietly. No one must know of his demise. Bring his effects to me. An intruder? Go. Do your part to liberate Corellia. This is a private matter. You don't want to get in the middle of this. Are you certain, June? You know what's required of you. Go. As you wish. May the Force be with you. You're persistent. Stubborn. I suppose that's why you excel at what you do, but the price is high. What won't a Mandalorian put aside for pride? I'd meet death head-on for a comrade. But would you kneel? You chose to murder Kelly and Jaro, just like you chose to kill everyone sent to bring you to justice. You could have surrendered at any time. You chose to become a murderer and terrorist. I only turned all that senseless destruction toward a righteous purpose. I'll have to correct that. No. Your rampage ends here. It's time to answer for your crimes. Buddy, I'm just getting started. I won't be the one after all. Now whose pride's getting them into trouble? Savor your vengeance. It's a small victory. You've denied me nothing here. In failure, I've undone all your accomplishments. In death, I return to the Force. I thought Jedi was supposed to be detached. Why'd you make this personal? If you believe you can distance yourself from the harm you cause, you're deluding yourself. <coughs> You're not some mindless tool. You're accountable. Your actions will catch up with you eventually. Pathetic. I did not see Saros. You were successful? Take a look for yourself. Only Jedi would call something this fragile battle master. Battle master some sort of special honor? Before our return, June Saros taught all Jedi the art of conflict. His death is a crippling blow to the Jedi Order. And without June Seras at his side, the Supreme Chancellor is exposed. Victory is close. That's going to get us the Supreme Chancellor? 
Once the encryption is broken, we will know this data's true value. You know more than you're letting on. June Seros came here aboard the Founder. He was privy to its security protocols, landing codes, even the Supreme Chancellor's itinerary. My subordinates will transmit the relevant data to your vessel when it's prepared. Until then, make yourself useful to Darth Decimus. The battle for Corellia is not yet decided. <laughs>